Hey, this is John Young. Today we're going to be looking at this. This is something that actually just came in and it's something I've been kind of excited about, but I wanted to get it for next summer. This is, you're looking at the peak up there of our of our house, which is up about 22 feet approximately. And in the summertime, you get, you get cobwebs and things up there and different little varmints, little insects, we'll call them. So I picked this up. This is... And just, I'm, I'm just unwrapping it here, and I want to just show you right off the bat what it can do. This is the DACA, right there, DACA pole. It's This one is the 24-foot one. There is also a 30. I think there's probably shorter versions also out there. But this is a an extension pole that has a variety of different pieces so that you can, from the ground, safely clean. And I'm just unwrapping here. Now, uh, the kit comes with some of these, and then uh, this is a Home Depot purchase, but you can find things like this in other places. It has a window washing kit, so you've got the squeegee there that you can do your thing on it and get uh, get it wet, do, your, do that, and switch and do that. It has a dust, let's see, it has our little dusting, dusting component there, and then it has a little scrub brushy device right here. This is probably the one that I use for this demonstration. And then I believe, if I'm not mistaken, this particular one was a second uh, a second purchase that uh, was an additional. Hey, maybe I'll use this one. This, this is the this is the all-purpose cleaning hat. Woo! So, so what this is is kind of based on a very similar, set those down there, similar to the pole saw that we used in one of our prior videos. That In this case, I want to be able to go and clean 30-some feet uh, up on there, 24 foot, I'm six foot. I could probably reach 30 feet, but that's not what I'm going to be doing. But this is a little head. It can be used as a hand wash, but that's not what we're here for today. The idea is that the house gets bugs on it, and it would be nice to be able to stay, keep up with them before they've been up there for a long time, and then they become problem children. So we're going to extend here. Let's see, is there a stop? Yes, there's a stop there. Nice. I was wondering about that because I just <laughs> was doing a different video and there wasn't a stop. It was like whoop, right on out on a different uh, a different extension. Actually, it was a uh, it was a, a uh, let me see. This one is oops, it's got to pop out, over around. There we go. Okay, so I've got I've got three extensions now. I do not have any power lines around by me. Let's give you an idea of how this where this is at right there. And I still have one extension to go. So let's just put that back in. Pop this one back. Pop this one out. There's a little clip on it that, uh, if I can show you this, there's a little a little clip right there that holds, holds the piece in. So it's got to kind of come out and then around that. Okay, so... I mentioned that the house is, that's 22 feet up there. This is 24 feet on the extension. So obviously I can do much higher because I could, I could get up to with the 24 feet. Yeah, about 30 feet high, just short of 30 feet high. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to re take it down one notch and we'll do this right on video so you guys can see how easy it is to do that. Now... If I wanted to go and dust the side of the house, I can wipe those cobwebs down. I can wipe the cobwebs off that soffit area. Granted, there aren't any there because we cleaned it this fall, but I could uh, I could get through there without a ton of work. And then to put it back together, I gotta get it around that that little clip. And slide it back down. And I'm ready to put it away and take it apart and put it away and be good for that. Kind of a neat 
idea. Um, this is going to be something that's going to be used a variety of times throughout the season because, again, you get some bugs up there and it's better to keep up with them and the spiders that do their thing keep up with them than to let them start creating a huge residence up there. So this is, the again, 24-foot one. It extends probably a full 24 feet. There's a 30-foot. There's others. I'll put those links in the description below for the variety of different sizes, and you guys can go check those out. And if you've got a tough-to-reach spot and you need to clean again, this could be a great option for you. Once again, this is the the DACA pole here. And again, you can pick this up at Home Depot. For more tips and how-to videos, go to WeekendHandyman.com.